This is Sam. He just completed an immunoprecipitation. It is impossible for Sam to see his protein of interest. There are multiple bands and a lot of background. How can he avoid the messy background and keep the protein of interest? I can help you. If you use Chromatex GFP trap, the IP would look like this. Conventional antibodies have light and heavy chains. These chains appear in the SDS gel. Nanobodies are the binding domains of alpaca's heavy chain antibodies. They are composed of a single chain. The GFP trap uses the nanobody coupled with beads. That's why there are no antibody chain bands in the gel. The affinity of the GFP trap is high, so even low expressed proteins can be captured easily. With the GFP trap, you can use harsh washing conditions to remove background proteins. The result of your immunoprecipitation will look like this. Chromotex GFP trap is the gold standard in immunoprecipitation, and there are about 2,000 publications. Request a test sample and try it for yourself.